Previously with Rob and Shuri, Rob gets the boat all cleaned up, ready for transport to Arizona, and Shuri joins in to travel down with Rob. In this episode, Rob and Shuri view some beautiful scenery in Utah and end up spending a night in a casino parking lot. Good morning, everybody. This is day 13. We have driven 2,838 miles. And we just left Bend area, uh, heading towards Burns. And the difference on this trip, going back, is Sherry's with me. Yay! So we haven't had breakfast yet. We filled up the tank in the truck last night. There's a big old boat behind us. And uh, so far so good, everything's going all right. And uh, we'll tie in with you as we go. We'll give you some pictures of the road too. Well, we're almost uh, Burns, Oregon. We've traveled since the beginning of the trip, 2,937 miles. We're gonna break 3,000 pretty soon here. Just stop that little rest area. Cinder got a break. I got a break. I got a break. And we're ready to hit the road again. We had a little rest area out here. It's out in the middle of nowhere. It's not the best rest area, was it? A little dirty. A little dirty. But anyway, on we go. Bye. So right after we left here, we followed the GPS for a shortcut to get onto the highway, and oh my god, we turned left, got on the road, couldn't turn around, turned out to be eight miles of dirt road. Oh well, we just drove through, <laughs> cringed, and realized we had a filthy boat and trailer and truck. <laughs> and thank god we had a monsoon later to clean everything off. Hi guys, this is Rob and Sherry, and we just went through Winnemucca, which is in Nevada. We decided to divert to uh, Highway I-80, which goes to Utah. Roads are a little better, better shoulders. There's no shoulders where we're at. So uh, just being a little safer, it's gonna be take us a little, well, add about a half hour to our trip. Uh, we've gone 3,187 miles. And, uh, uh, since the beginning of this trip so anyway it's all miles so Cinder's doing all right we're all kind of getting back in the mojo here and uh, uh, off we go So far we've driven 3,351 miles and we are still 150 miles from Salt Lake City or more. Or more. So we're at a Love's truck stop, total ins insanity, and we're eating McDonald's again. again. <laughs> and so and Cinder gets her french fries. Thanks. I have never ate a McDonald's so much. <laughs> And McDonald's after this trip, I'm going to take a break from you. <laughs> well, it was almost the end of the night here, but guess where we're sleeping tonight? In a boat. And guess where we're at? A casino. So, still, we're still camping in a boat. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. So sleeping in a boat in a casino can be a little noisy with music in the parking lot. So we didn't probably sleep as good as we wanted to, but... Driving across the border into Utah, coming around the rocks here, and this was the salt flats. And oh my gosh, uh, unfortunately my windshield is a little dirty from the dirt road before, <laughs> but it was beautiful. Good morning people, this is day number 14. We've traveled 
3,419 miles. So yeah, since uh, we began this trip, we uh, slept in the boat last night in a parking lot in a casino at the border of Nevada and Utah. So anyway, we're back on the road and started out with a nice sunrise. We do. We should be at Page today. Yeah. So uh, we're getting there. Oh, I'm sure he is alive. Yeah. So talk to you later. Bye. Folks, we've uh, hit 3,722 miles, <laughs> and we're at a little rest area, beautiful place in Utah. Between, wow, well, we just went through Richfield and going over the passes, and uh, just uh, going through this pass was outstanding. Wait, right, let me uh, step out for a minute, let you see what we see. Right, yeah, welcome to Utah. What a nice stop. Well, anyway, I'm gonna go stretch a little bit, uh, send her walk around and take a breather and then back on the road. This rest area just outside of Ridgefield is a perfect example of Utah's beauty and nature. It had rock formations, a small stream going through it, and just elegant. So just sit back for a moment and enjoy the beauty of Utah. Back in the road we went, heading towards Lake Powell, but Utah still had some beauty to show us. 
So enjoy our passage through Utah. And yes, there it is, Lake Powell. We've finally made it to our destination. You cannot comprehend at this point how relieved we are that we made it here. And at this point, we also are realizing what a vast, gigantic lake this is. And we we're coming in in the evening, and it was absolutely beautiful calm, quiet, and of course, we're lost. So we just keep kind of driving, working our way down to the lake, trying to figure out where we're supposed to go, and some of the signs didn't exactly make sense to us, but we just kept going until we got down to the resort itself. Then found a parking lot for overflow boats and trailers, and turned in, and you'll see Right ahead of us, this little guy in a cart shows up, and what a kind gentleman he was. So it was getting too late to launch the boat, so we found that this would be a great place to spend the night sleeping in the boat. Stay tuned next time when Robert Sherry wake up the next morning in the parking lot and launch the boat for the first time. And show you glimpses of what Lake Powell has in store for us. Thank you for watching our videos. Please take the time to subscribe and consider being a Patreon supporter. There is many more adventures and some big surprises coming in the future with your help. Thanks again.